when your fuse are going down like <laughs> like this then there's only one way to save your channel you gotta come up with an original ID for a new series and I got the best original ID ever I came up with it all by myself Road to sponsor everybody Road to sponsor Easy fuse Easy YouTube money Road to sponsor Hell yeah Okay, so I've actually had this idea for quite a while already uh, I am I'm not copying I Hamo, uh, <laughs> but I wanted to do this series uh, after I finished Phoenix to Da Vinci. But now I see that well, someone else is already doing it. I thought, well, let's just start with it before other people start doing it too. And then I'm just some asshole who copies other people. I bought a new microphone, by the way. Do you guys uh, like the the new sound quality? Hell yeah, boy! Hell yeah! Anyways, uh, road to sponsor. Alright, hey everybody, we are in game right now. Let's take a look at all the achievements that I gotta complete to be able to sponsor an item. Um, yeah, yeah. Goes and goes. Alright, let's take a look. Uh, we need to catch a perfect stonefish, so for that I need a golden rod. Uh, I need to sew a wool scarf. I need to lock a world with an emerald lock. Plant a wizard staff tree, forge an iron buckle, achieve 100% awesomeness, craft a xenonite crystal, hatch a black crystal dragon, beat a blanket cape out of a super villain, buy a riding bumblebee or a riding raven in the gem shop, buy a gone pickaxe for grow tokens, okay so I need to save up grow tokens, uh, buy the flochiston, buy the flochiston, buy the floch, floch, Get a ghost charm from a spirit storage explosion. Compact the dress into a mystery dress. Blah, 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 blah. 200 combustive works. Okay, I need to do a whole lot of shit before I can sponsor an item. I do want you guys to know that, like, the goal is to sponsor an item eventually. But I'm not going to grind every episode to get more world locks like I'm doing in Phoenix to Da Vinci. In Phoenix to Da Vinci, I'm just like getting world logs getting world logs getting world logs and in this series i also just want to have fun while doing it so i might not always make world logs i just want to have fun in grotopia and eventually sponsor an item that's the goal of the series anyways um in this first episode well one of the achievements is to get 100% uh, awesomeness so i'm definitely going to do those quests today to get more percent awesomeness because i'm at uh what am i at i'm at 21 percent right now so i definitely need to start doing those more often um i also need to be level 99 and i'm level 71 right now so i gotta do a lot of farming hell yeah boy farming Okay, I'm just going to start off here by harvesting my ATMs real quick. I literally never harvest them. I think I got about a thousand of them. Epic harvest time. This is so boring! Okay, so I realized that I forgot to show you guys uh, which achievements I have already completed before I started the series uh, on my account. And that is Discover the Truth, Dress Up as Locker. You can see that in one of my different videos, the link is in the description. I did that on camera, so that's pretty cool. Um, own a top 10 rated world, complete a massive trauma surgery, well that one is really easy. Find a topaz block in a golden treasure hoard. I think I also did that one in a video, but I'm not sure. Uh, collect all four treasures in Valhalla. I definitely did that on camera. And getting a teddy bear from an awkward friendly unicorn. I also recorded that. So almost every quest that I completed already has been on camera. So I'm 
really happy with that. And now it's time to get some more awesomeness. Hell yeah. Okay, so I'm in my world called Terry Farm. And I'm going to do the, the quests right now to get awesomeness. Let's see. Goals here. Okay, one is earn 1600 XP. Well, I all already did that, so hooray! I'll give you two pointy sign seeds. Thank you very much. Uh, smash a thousand blocks and deliver 20 steel girders. Steel girder. Alright, let's buy those steel girders first. Alright, let's buy those bitches. Um, where they at, boy? Here they are. There we go. Five world locks. That's overpaid, Terry. Fuck you. I don't care. Okay, smashing a thousand blocks is really fucking boring to do. But I'm going to smash chickens. And they can drop all kind of shit. They can drop a chicken leash. They can drop the rideable chicken. So this will make it a little bit more exciting to break them. Uh, yeah. Also, once again, I'm not going to grind for world locks in every episode. If I grinded for world locks that badly, I would have probably sold these chickens. But I'm going to break them. Fuck that shit, boy. Um, yeah. I just want to have fun with this series. It's not all about going to that end goal. It's just about having fun in the game and making videos. Because that's what I like doing. So, shit, shit, shit the fuck, shit the fuck up, shit the fuck up. Ah, there we go. We broke all the chickens. Hell yeah. All right, two more. Boom and boom. Okay, awesome. How many blocks have I braked? Broken? Braked? I don't fucking know English. Uh, okay, 200 more. Let's actually just break 200 dirt. I don't even fucking care anymore, boy. And uh, replant the trees. I don't know why I'm replanting this, actually. Yeah, wait. Why the fuck am I replanting? Fuck that shit. I want to keep those and sell them. Uh, let's go to a random world and break some dirt to complete this stupid ass boring bitch quest. No hate. Please don't lock my world. Please. Don't don't steal my world. I have chat off, sorry. I can't read what you're saying. Okay, wait, let me put chat back on. Oh, he wants to trade with me. What's up, man? Ooh. A very, very nice. Let's just give him a world lock. No, 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 no. <laughs> That's a world lock. Well spent it. Hell yeah. Are you going to say thank you or anything? No! No! Why would you? No! <laughs> what the fuck? Why would he do that? Oh my god, my voice. <clears throat> Sorry. I gave him a world lock and he banned me. <laughs> what you say? Mm, that you only meant well, but of course you did. Mm, what you say? Mm, that it's all for the dark. Hey, I completed the quest. Hell yeah, boy. Let's go to my world again. All right, all right, all right. I completed it. That's 20 minutes of my life. I'm never getting back. Hell yeah. I'm so happy with what I'm doing with my life. All right, turn in. Boom. Got all the quests completed. 24% awesomeness. All I can say is awesome. Okay, so the quest that I thought would be fun to do in this very first episode is buy the plochiston for pet trainer medals. Flochis, flochis, flo that leash, that fire leash thingy that you can buy with pet trainer medals. Yes, that one. Yes. I don't know how to pronounce that shit. Oh well. Okay, I got to buy 70. Let's start off by buying 20.
Okay, guys, I got 70 pet trainer whistles right now, and I got the battle leash. I believe I still have pets. Hell yeah, okay, awesome. All right, let's defeat 70 pet trainers, boy. Um, how does this work again? I wear my thingy like that, and then I punch him. Bring it on. Oh, you're too close. Okay, let's do it like that. Bring it on, bitch. Um... It's a long time ago I did this shit. Uh, wait, how does it do it? Antler bash. Boom. I didn't even know that they added that you can see which attack you're doing. Um, what's happening? I don't know what's happening. Claws out. Come on, do an attack. Hell yeah, boy. Boom. The lion is my favorite pet. If you, look, if you do it and he attacks me right now, it does damage. Yeah, look, he attacked me and he almost killed himself by doing that. And after that, the antler and the, uh, whatever it's called, the antler head and the bunny thing are also pretty strong. Um, why can't I fucking attack me? Attack me, bitch! Do it! Boom! First one done. 69 to go. 69. Okay, well. 69 to go, everybody. Hell yeah. That was a close one, actually. Legendary Dragon! Oh, shit, boy. Finally. That's pretty cool. Let's see if he can beat me. I'm the best. Um, I think the dragon does, like, 50 damage or something like that. I don't know. But it has a lot of cooldown. It has, like, 30 seconds cooldown or something. Let's see if we can defeat the Legendary Dragon, everybody. Okay, claws out. Come on, attack me, man. Attack me. Come on. Okay, good job. I'm winning this one. I'm definitely winning this one. Even though I'm fighting against a legendary dragon. More like a legendary bitch. Ho <laughs> ho! There you go. You dead, boy. You fucking dead, boy. Alright, let's buff up and end him. I'm gonna end you. Bam. Alright, that was the legendary dragon, everybody. Six and a half hours later. Okay, attack me please. Good job, you're dead. 
Alright everybody, um, I did 35 battles right now because I started with uh, 70 whistles and I got 65 medals right now. But I'm going to end the episode here actually because, uh, let's see, um, yeah, I've been recording for an hour and 30 minutes right now. And well, I really can't record any longer because it's pretty late and I gotta edit this video and yeah. So in the next video we'll definitely finish the quest and get the leash, whatever it's called. We'll get the leash in the next episode and wait, let's actually harvest the unicorns real quick. Here we go. Okay, didn't get anything good. Well, hope you enjoyed that. That's, uh, how long? 30 seconds or something? You'll never get back. Enjoy. <laughs> Alright, uh, yeah, we'll finish the quest in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this new series. Let me know what you think. And, yeah, see you guys in the next one. Peace.